Each interior has a corner which is really challenging. In this interior, it was the surface between the instrument cluster and the monitor. Really challenging. I think it took about almost one month to, to get handle this corner. In the rear, BMW now offers individual automatic climate controls for each passenger, as well as rear seat entertainment. The new 5 Series sedan has clearly gained comfort for every passenger. A perfectly customized car, an aesthetic exterior that looks tailor-made. A closer look reveals how BMW's designers crafted this perfect combination of elegance and sportiness. The large upright kidney grille demonstrates the new engine power below the hood. Deeply sculptured lines underline the car's athletic appeal. The kidney-shaped grille is now lower and wider uh, than it is on many other BMWs. Uh, and that, um, together with these uh, sharp lines and the proportions, exude uh, to our minds uh, sportiness uh, and also enhance the elegance. The headlights appear slightly to be cut off at the top and thus create the typical focused expression of BMW models. You put in the headlamp something like the eyebrow uh, you know, it's then the car looks really like uh, he concentrate on the road. The new 5 Series sedan is only 5 centimeters longer than its predecessor, but a coupe-like roofline and a stretched seam line make the car appear much longer. Um, through its proportions, it looks very long, very stretched, and uh, that is something that makes a car very elegant. The elegant character of the side is completed by an interplay of light and darkness together with sculptured areas to create a sporty, athletic impression. The overall I had in my mind was uh, balance, beauty, uh, it was uh, masculine with muscles. Several design elements achieve the masculine character of the rear. Prominent muscular wheel wells, horizontal design lines, and three-dimensional surfaces. L-shaped LED taillights with three interior light panels describe the new BMW nighttime look. Well, the 5 Series um, is a car for people that really know a lot about BMW, that love BMW. And they know uh, as much about BMW as we do almost. So uh, in that sense, it has to be 100% uh, true and true BMW.